Welcome. Today we're going to scrap this DVD player. Got this out of a computer tower. There's usually four screws in the bottom here that I've already taken out. Hopefully that'll make it a little easier to part with. The bottom part, steel piece. You see, we want to save this circuit board that we're just popping out of here. Put that in with the gold scrap. Some gold pin connectors in the back there. Ribbon wiring in here. Always pull those out. Always rip the front plastic off. See if we can get the bottom piece off here. Another piece of steel. Under this short piece is usually a motor. There you go, right here. There you go, a little motor for you. At this point, basically you can choose to just smash smash it to get the rest of the uh, material out of it in the middle. There you go. That's it. That's all just plastic. Now on some of these drives, you want to check the outside. This one looks like it's steel. Some of them are actually aluminum. You want to check on that. Uh, there's a little motor here. This, this piece of metal that sticks out, check that. Sometimes uh, that's brass. Some more ribbon cable in here. There's another motor in here. Small circuit board. There's a little tiny bit of copper inside there. There's a ton of little tiny screws in here. So if you want to take those out, uh, this, this metal on the top here, a thin piece, could be aluminum. The, the main housing of this part right here is aluminum. If you feel like taking off the little tiny screws, or throw it in the pile of things to do when you're bored. So you have uh, three motors, maybe a little piece of brass, some ribbon cable, and probably a little aluminum on top of here. It, Thin aluminum and then some cast aluminum in there. And a little bit of copper inside this little motor. And that's about it. Thanks for watching. Good luck.